Welcome to Wildcats Basketball Weekly, presented by Hughes Federal Credit Union, home of the official U of A Visa debit card. Show your Wildcat spirit and get your free debit card today. Visit them at HughesFCU.org, federally insured by NCUA. Coach, two good wins in the Bay Area, and one of the, the key things that stood out, your bench play, 50 points off your bench. How valuable was that at this point of the season? Very valuable, and you know, when you think of our bench, it's, it's really Dusan, it's Parker, Elliott, and Gabe at this point. And if you thought back to the Oregon trip, which is our first Pac-12 road trip, Brian, those guys, not as much Elliott and Gabe because they're older, but Parker and Dusan, they struggled a little bit in those first two road games, which is expected. And every once in a while, we have to remind ourselves, Stanley is also a freshman. And if you think to his Oregon State game, that was the first time of a number of things that he was going through as well. But it was great to see those games come and go, us play some more games. And then when we had the opportunity to go on the road a second time, I thought those guys were much more confident and sure of themselves. And and that's not only a good sign for our future, but I'm really happy for both of those guys, Parker and Dusan, because uh, to me, they work as hard in our program as any two guys and very talented. We're counting on them and they did an excellent job. Your team hasn't lost since that game in Corvallis. What other things have gone into this winning streak right now for your team? Well, we're not getting too far ahead of ourselves. Uh, every day, it, we're really trying to accomplish something, getting better in practice, approaching a shoot around, how you want to approach it, and that is not only an opportunity to get ready for tonight's game, but an opportunity to continue to develop and get better. We've talked a lot since the beginning of the school year that those teams who have a way of continuing to develop and improve all the way to March, not just for a month and then stay still and then all of a sudden get better again, but a constant focus on improving. Those are the ones who have great seasons. And right now, we're not very far away from February. We have a lot of basketball behind us, but I think our team is doing as good of a job as we've done all year on making what we're doing important. In the desert southwest, there is a dominant force delivering powerful results with unmatched capabilities and dynamic leadership from the people who brought you U of A debit cards and banking at your fingertips, Hughes Federal Credit Union. Hughes, that's my team. Let's do this. Wow, an Academy Award winner, right, Wilbur? Wildcat Basketball Weekly continues, presented by Hughes Federal Credit Union. Sean, there's a lot of statistics that go into basketball. Your team's leading the Pac-12 in turnover margin. What does that mean to you in terms of your team's ultimate success? Well, that's, that's a stat that really hasn't meant a lot in the past. Uh, we obviously want to be a low turnover team. And last year, as you know, Brian, we, we were great at not turning the ball over. Uh, in many ways, that's why we went 15 and three in the Pac-12, because that statistic was so overwhelming in our favor. I think we played many games uh, consistently with 10 or fewer, and I think we averaged in and around 10 and a half turnovers a game. So we're on the right track there. I think we averaged maybe one and a half more. Uh, I think that can get better, but we usually don't turn the other team over, and so far we have. I think that's a function of our personnel more than maybe what we're trying to do strategically so the, the statistic that means the most the way we play is rebounding the margin our offensive rebounding production percentage that we get back versus what we allow our our opponent when that's in place that's usually when we're difficult to beat all right and the wildcats lead the conference in rebound margin right now so that that is a huge that's stat a big one. okay uh great fan support i mean you got incredible fans at McHale Center. When you go on the road and you're in Berkeley, for example, and the building's almost taken over by Arizona fans, is that noticeable to the players and the coaches? Very much so. We notice that when you come out for the game and then 
you notice it uh, at the end of the game. And I think that's why we want to win the game so badly because uh, we know that we're playing in front of uh, the greatest fans you can have as a college basketball coach or player, really. I mean, there are others that you would put in our category, but I don't know if any are more passionate or more loyal than, than our fans. And you're right, in the Bay especially, it just seems like we have a great group up there, both at Stanford and at Cal, we heard them. Thank you for watching Wildcat Basketball Weekly, presented by Hughes Federal Credit Union, home of the official U of A debit card. Visit them at HughesFCU.org, federally insured by NCUA.